Okay, so Shiba Inu has formed its first death cross of 2023. And that's what we're going to talk about in this video. As always, thanks for your support. I truly appreciate you. We're going to talk about this. What does this mean? Is this a uh, is this a, a you know a death knell? What does this really mean? That's like an interesting word, death knell. You ever heard that? It's an old word. All right, so I'm going to show you exactly what's going on. As always, thanks for your support. And here is what we're talking about. So SHIB has formed its first death cross of 2023. So what is a death cross? A death cross is a bearish indicator it's a bearish pattern okay where whereby um right here it is the daily moving average uh 50 has recently crossed under the moving average the 200 day so the 50 day the 200 day uh this has pattern has not appeared since february of 2022 you can see right there now is this an overly bad thing is this a is this something that is like signaling the end no this is a pattern that presents itself at times okay let me show you kind of currently what is going on in crypto. If you take a look at SHIB right here, you can see that SHIB is at five zeros eight uh, seven seven. Okay. And if we look at kind of the one month chart, you see this move down. Now, this move down looks dramatic, right? This move down, but it's really not per se. You had four zeros, one, one, and change. And now we're down to five zeros eight. This move down is not a Shiba Inu specific thing, which Back to this point of this death cross scenario, okay, I want to point out the fact that the entire crypto market has moved down in this same period and the entire crypto market is languishing, is not doing a lot. And so this is not a specific thing or a warning sign of more bad to come for SHIB. This is an overall kind of macro market scenario that we really do see playing out here. And again, I wanted to point that out right now. If the if the water is getting a little too choppy or warm for you, so to speak, or whatever metaphor works for you and you feel like you need to get out of ship, so be it. That's your call. Right. But me, I'm staying put. I know that this is just kind of part and parcel of it. And by the way, we've got a lot of people that are buying at these levels. So that's be the right thing for you. OK, so with that said, just kind of wanted to make you aware of this. This is not a necessarily a bad thing, per se. It's part of it is what it is right now. And this is kind of where we're at in overall crypto uh, kind of a macro factors that are impacting specific, you know, specific cryptos. SHIB presenting its first death cross, which sounds really, really, really horrific. But it is a it's a trading pattern. It's, it, you know, it's a bearish trading pattern. And right now, I think we're in that we're going to be here in these bearish waters or the scenario for quite a little bit. All right. See you.